Today's adventure begins by looking at the Easter Bunny over there, the side of this house that is always decorated for every holiday here in celebration. Two days until Easter, as the recording of this, it is Friday, March 29th, 2024. Hello. I was climbing out of the in and out of that flower pot. Look at little, little chicks here. Got Mickey and Minnie up on the porch. See them up there in the shadows. These are very artistic bunny rabbits. I love these little minions here five minions in this section and five minions there. Total of 10 pink bunny minions. <laughs> That's similar to Christmas. Easter also has two, two meanings to different people. And I'm gonna kind of focus on the secondary meaning other than the Easter bunny. There's a church here in town that always does a live nativity during Christmas time, but they also do one during Easter that I have never attended, so I'm going to check that out. It's right downtown. Should be interesting. Welcome everyone. Out of the woo here. TGIF. It is Good Friday. I got my golf cart over there, my mini Marge, my glorified golf cart. I'm just going to cruise around town and enjoy a, a Friday Eve. I'm inviting you to join me. I'm starting to get used to this. Not really, but kind of. Join me. Shall you? Weather's really nice, 77 degrees at the moment. It's gonna get down to 74 in about another two hours. Not bad, the event at the church takes place at 7.30. Yeah, so I got a solid two hours before that begins. Plenty of time to wander around, get myself a piping hot caffeinated beverage, a large coffee. Feels good out. It's a good day. It's a good Friday. I didn't mean to put that two and two together. Yeah, it's technically good Friday. I was passing by here the other day. This is Community Presbyterian. Again, they did the live nativity during Christmas. I've attended the last couple of years. And it says, step into the Easter story. Now on Palm Sunday, which was last Sunday on March 24th, they did an event, and they also did something called Maundy Thursday. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correct, but that was yesterday. And then today, of course, is this. I'm not familiar with what the Thursday name would be, but it's the Last Supper. You could pray in the Garden in Gethsemane. So as I'm filming this, that was last night. Today... Friday here. Oh yeah, I'm excited about a little, getting a little large, well not a little, but a large caffeine intake into my system here. To have trouble finding parking down here. There is two spots right over there where that truck and the other car behind it is that's specifically for the carts. But I found parking anyway, but I kind of wish they'd just take the signs down. Yeah, it's pretty busy downtown. I would imagine as the night kind of unfolds a little, we'll probably get a little busier. In fact, over there they are doing a a wedding. There's a wedding taking place, so pretty, pretty. Oh, they're making an announcement. Yeah, there's a private wedding happening over there, and a lot of people. Yep. Ah, golf carts are plenty out here. Yeah, cool. Was had a little buddy, a little turtle buddy. They were going up. They almost like shared a very intimate moment. I got kind of worried for the turtle there for a minute. I thought maybe cool would be like a little snippy. But the turtle ended up uh, kind of veering off. Saved himself a little, uh, little, little snip in the nose, which is probably a good thing. Decided to go ahead and get back in the cart, ride around a little bit, got some time, heading down Water Street, see if I can find some Easter decor around town before finding another parking spot and going back over to the event. Also, this is now officially the longest I have ever had a mustache in my entire life. Last time I had one. I had it one day, shaved it off. Now this is day two that I've had the stash going on. I think I'm going to keep it for a little bit. I'm not going to have it forever. It's not going to be a permanent thing, but I am going to keep it 
a series of days. It's growing on me. Uh, come on, it's a bad joke, but. Oh, here's some Easter decor. Even like the little bunnies down there by the mailbox. Easter decor. It's so cute how all these houses just go all out. Not as They don't go all out as much for Easter as they do for Halloween and Christmas, but it is nice to see some Easter decor. A lot of bunnies up there. Got the carrots, got the eggs up in the trees. And then up there on the balcony, there's a bunny rabbit. Classic car alert. Nice. There is a monthly news news gazette they put out here called the Celebration News. All the residents get. And if you don't get one, you can get them from the little little substations here, the little plastic newsstands. No quarter or 50 cent pieces needed. Complimentary. be interesting to see how that this turns out obviously when they do the live nativity for Christmas it's kind of cute and you know, with the manger scene and all that this is a little bit different vibe than that with the you know, the cross and the trial and the conviction and the crucifixion so gonna be a diff different experience than the live nativity. It's gonna be happening right here on the streets of Celebration. Ah, floating bags are beautiful. It's a movie reference, but that's not a bag. That's, that looks like a balloon. I always like this dedication plaque right here. Dedicated to the glory of God and loving memory of dear uncles Walt and Roy Disney. Got the entrance into Jerusalem here. Got the seats all set up over here. People starting to file in step into the Easter story, and they usually have something written on the side of this. Today they have Embrace the Journey of Holy Week. Let it renew your spirit. And they got it all themed out accordingly. I believe they're handing out some little pamphlets and brochures, so I'll make sure I get one of those as well. All right, this is the program. He died so you could live Holy Week experience. Good Friday program starting at 7.30, the Community Presbyterian Church. I'm going to start off with a prayer, then some songs, Amazing Grace, Nothing But the Blood, and then they're going to have a moment of reflection, 39 lashes, the trial, uh, the trial of Jesus, the live drama, another song, and then they're going to have the crucifixion, and then the burial, and then they're going to have the closing words and the invitation by Pastor William there. So there's going to be a few live dramas in between the songs as well. The living God, you've made access for us to yourself through Jesus, our Lord and Savior. So release your spirit upon us now. Circulate upon us and within us as we take a close look at the resurrection, the cross, the life of Jesus Christ. Therefore, the one who handed me over to you is guilty of a greater sin. Pilate asked Jesus, if you are the son of your God and a king, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one thing. 
36, 37, 38. charge of Jesus and ordered him to carry his cross to the hill outside Jerusalem where he was to be crucified. Jesus had already fallen under the weight of the cross. But each time he's pulled up and forced to continue. He's exhausted and weak from loss of blood. He seems likely to fall again at any moment. But he has to carry his own cross to the place of execution. Let's go. with him, one on his left and one on his right. And the soldiers cast lots to divide his garments, and the people stood by watching. But the rulers scoffed at him, saying, You who would destroy the temple to build it in three days, save yourself. If you are the Son of God, Come down from the cross. He is the king of Israel. Let him come down from the cross. And we will believe in him then. Forgive them. For they know not what they do. Near the cross of Jesus. Woman. Here is your son. Here is your mother. It was about noon 
and darkness came over the whole land until three in the afternoon. My God! My God! What have you forsaken me? Later, knowing that everything had now been finished, and so that scripture would be fulfilled, he said his last words. It is finished. Father, into your hands I commend my spirit. Now Joseph was a disciple of Jesus, but, but secretly, because he feared the Jewish leaders. And with Pilate's permission, he came and took the body away. He was accompanied by Nicodemus, the man who earlier had visited Jesus at night. And Nicodemus brought a mixture of myrrh and aloes, about 75 pounds. Taking Jesus' body, the two of them wrapped it with the spices in strips of linen. This was in accordance with Jewish burial customs. And at the place where Jesus was crucified, there was a garden. And in the garden, a new tomb in which no one had ever been laid. And because it was the Jewish day of preparation, and since the tomb was nearby, they laid Jesus there. The women who had come with Jesus from Galilee followed Joseph and saw the tomb and how his body was laid in it. Meanwhile, the chief priests and the Pharisees went to Pilate. Sir, we remember that while he was still alive, that deceiver said, after three days, I will rise again. So give the orders for the tomb to be made secure until the third day. Otherwise, his disciples may come and steal the body and tell the people that he had been raised from the dead. And this last deception will be worse than the first. Pilate answered, take guards. Go make the tomb as secure as you know how. So they went and made the tomb secure by putting a seal on the stone and posting the guards. I am. Is this your tomb? It is. Has the Nazarene been laid here? By order of your commander. Okay, guards, come to the rock.
tonight I'd like to walk you through Good Friday. Jesus was beaten and interrogated all through the night. And in the early morning hours, the Jews showed up at Pilate. So Pilate sends Jesus to Herod. Herod's been wanting to meet Jesus, but Jesus has no regard for him and speaks not to him. So Herod mocks him and beats him and sends him back to Pilate, where Pilate ends up giving Jesus the 39 lashes. This would be Christ's third beating in less than 12 hours. First came the Jews, then Herod's beating, but now the Romans. And, and to be scourged by the Romans was a terrifying experience of heart. And actually begins to defend Jesus' innocence. You know, Jesus' sinlessness, innocence, it's a core doctrine of our faith. He was sinless when he went to the cross and transferred that sinlessness to you and me. A relationship with God is now yours to be enjoyed. This is Good Friday. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Friends, we're going to bring a cross down to the front here. And I'm going to invite you to take a nail and a hammer. Whatever sin is that issue between you and God, that struggle you have, handing it over to Him, that's robbing you of life, eternal life, abundant life, let's nail it in the cross tonight so that you can experience life with God. take the card out too much at night but nightfall has reared its head now heading home I got uh, lights on or lights on this so headlights just like a automobile would have so I was talking to one of the uh, people who go to the church there and they were saying trying to draw it a blank on what the, that would be called one of the congre the, one of the people in the congregation that's the sort of word I'm looking for and the guy that was playing Jesus is the same actor that was at Holy Land for years. So I guess Holy Land lives on in a roundabout way during a Holy Week on Good Friday here in Celebration. And that was the only other time I saw that story of Jesus. I've seen a lot of live nativities and, and that over, over time. But I do not recall ever seeing the events that transpire on Good Friday presented in a, in a live recreation like that before. Man, the guy from Holy Land, he's still doing his thing. All right, that's gonna do it for today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.
a little different, but I wanted to cover it. You know, something that happens here in town, happens at the church, I wanted to give a little frame of reference of, the, of Easter, uh, something other than the Easter Bunny, and it's not every day you see something like that happen anywhere. I'll see you in the next video. The vlog is over. <laughs>